There are two message settings that I want to go over that will tell the receiver how to treat your email messages, including importance and sensitivity. For importance, you can mark it as low, normal, or high. For sensitivity, it can be normal, personal, private, or confidential. And I got this message I want to send off to Carrie about throwing a surprise birthday party for Mr. Humphreys in a couple of weeks. So the importance, I could say, is high because we've got to get right on it. We want to make sure we don't miss his birthday, and we want to throw a surprise birthday party to keep it a surprise. I'll say the sensitivity is confidential or private. In other words, don't share it, especially with Mr. Humphreys. Well, everybody else, so they know what's going on. In any case, to go ahead and mark these settings for the message, you can do it one of a couple of ways. Either come up here on the Message tab and go to the Tags group, and for the importance, you can mark it high there, and you can see it's selected or low. Let's go to High, and then for the sensitivity, click on the expandable dialog box button for the Tags group, click on it, and you can see we're in the Properties window for the settings. There's Importance High, so if I change it to Low, it'll update it when I close out to Low. And for the sensitivity, instead of Normal, let's make it Private. Then go ahead and click Close, and it flips to Low. Now, if you're on the Options tab, you can come over here to the More Options and click its expandable dialog box button, and it's the same window. And so what you do there, let's mark it as high. Close will also update it on the Message tab in the Tags group. There you go. High importance. Muy importante. Let's go ahead and click Send, and away it goes. And as you recall, every time we send off a message, it stores a copy of it over in the Sent Items folder, what we sent off. And you can see right there in that exclamation mark column, it's the importance column. So you see an exclamation mark there, then, hey, oh, that's really important. And you can double click to open it up to see what you sent. Please treat as private with high importance. And that's the same thing that she's going to get on her end. In fact, let me go ahead and have Carrie send us an email message so I can show you what it looks like when you get one with those settings set. And let's come up here, click on send receive. And there we go. Hey, red exclamation mark. Oh, that's important. Double click. And you can see in the information area, please treat this as confidential. So if somebody's looking over your shoulder, you can go, at that, 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 that. excuse us, I'm having a private reading here with this confidential email. And then this message was sent with high importance. So you'll see the high importance when you're looking at the message in the inbox, but you'll also see it tagged here. But as far as sensitivity, you have to actually open it up to read it here in the information area. And then, of course, you can come up here, click on the expandable dialog box button for the tags group. You can't change the sensitivity, but you can change the high if you're like, yeah, okay, haunted house investigation, not my priority here. I'm going to set it to low. Click close. It updates it here to low importance. And then when you close out, be sure to save it, you can see it turns into a blue arrow pointing down. So that's what it's going to look like as well if she sends me an email message with being a low importance. It's just a downer, isn't it? Why even open it up? Well, it's got some importance. Maybe it's an FYI, so at least you can know that there's an investigation going on. I wouldn't totally dismiss it. And so you can go ahead and change that. And then if you want to go ahead with it selected, click on Forward and see what options you get. Well, you can change it. Hey, this is high importance. I'm going to send it to Mr. Humphreys. And click on the expandable dialog box button for the tags and maybe change it to normal. There's nothing in the information area that's going to show, because when it's normal, you know, why show anything? But if it's personal, private, or confidential, it'll pop up there. And then, of course, if you set it to normal here as well, then you'll have nothing in the information area showing anything, because it's all normal. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel to get notified of the latest videos. And for great specials on my products, please see the description below this video.